It's, uh, I'm Ethan Moore from Stockroom Supply. Um, I just got done filming my compostable bag video and I had an idea. I don't know if it's going to work and I don't I have no idea what's going to happen here. But what I'm going to do here, this is going to be a test, a competition between two dust collectors. Um, I've got the Rycon 2 horsepower with the Nanomax with a 4 inch hose connected to this Y. Then I've got the Record Power 90 liter cam back. Same thing, connected to the Y. And then what I'm going to do is put a hose on this end and suck up some sawdust. What we're going to do is see which dust collector collects more sawdust out of the same inlet here. So it'll be an interesting little competition. Um, I have my bag as empty as I could get it there. And then if you look inside my cam vac, again, I have it <coughs> as empty as I could get it. So. Yeah, let me set up to do this video here. I got my bin full of sawdust here. You can check that out. I got my hose hooked up. So I'm going to turn both these units on, suck up some dust, and see what happens. All right. So about halfway gone. Wow, that's fast. Yeah, this is powerful. definitely see there's some in the dust collector here. Let's open them both out, dump them out, and see what there's more of. I need to find two equal size bins here. One second. Okay, I got my two equal size buckets here. I'm going to empty the Rikon first into the black one. Then we'll empty the record power of the can back into the off-white one here. So, yeah, I'm, I'm curious to see. I know they both got, they both got on the side. You haven't even looked in the cam back yet. I haven't even looked. I have no idea. We're going to empty them both in. We'll measure. We'll put a stick in there or something to see which pile of sawdust is tall. I want to make sure I get every ounce of dust in here I can. Okay. So... That's the right one, let me just put this aside. Okay, You're gonna measure one. after you have Yeah, them. we'll measure after, it might be obvious. I think it's gonna be pretty obvious. Judging by that. Do you think? I thought there was more, honestly, I thought there was more you know, than that in the right one. Hang on, should I, um, big reveal? Sure. Oh my goodness. I should have brought this outside first, but we're just gonna set this aside right here. Huh. I, I think I know who won. This, this container might not be big enough. Um, whoa. <laughs> You're gonna vacuum up after, right? <laughs> <laughs> Just keep going. <laughs> I was overflowed, I guess. Yeah, you're back in anyway. It's already a mess. It's just. <laughs> hey. Well. That's how much a Rikon got there. And that's how much the cam back got. So I think it's a pretty clear winner. I thought it'd be closer, to be honest. Sorry, Mom, I'm in. <laughs> well, it's okay. I just was going to And the other thing I was going to mention, because I wasn't sure how this was going to affect things, but if you look at this inlet here, the can back is going off in a 45 degree angle. 
Technically, that's a slight disadvantage because this guy was going straight on through. To make this fair, should you switch them? I should, but then the cam back's just going to wipe the floor, so... Are you sure? Yeah, well, I mean, <laughs> it's only going to make it better. I guess I could, but I don't feel like cleaning up more than once, to be honest. So. Okay, so my mom and my sister think, for whatever reason, that the cam back had an advantage because the angle went to it first and somehow they're trying to convince me that this one because it's it exits first is somehow an advantage so just to appease them though i know that's not the case because it's actually worse i reverse this so now we have the rikon with the split off and the cam back goes straight on through so we just move that fitting the opposite way we're going to do the exact same test and see what happens but i'm actually glad we're doing this because I noticed something really cool about the sawdust that I didn't um, until I was dumping all the sawdust back together. So I want to show you guys that too. So let me suck this up. We'll see what happens. Do the same thing as before, just with the fitting in the opposite way. same thing and let's see what the results are all right I'm gonna take the uh, Raycon bag off here we'll dump it in that black bucket and then we'll do the same with the record if I'm being honest a whole lot less than this bag than there was last time so your theory my theory is, is correct. correct well there's hardly any there's a little bit here okay Whoa. Wow, it's amazing the difference that made though. So that's what I had this time. Oh dear. Wow, that's a significant So that's just because of that angle though. That made that big a difference. Um, I mean, it's still interesting to still redo it and see that. Yeah, see the difference that actually made though. Take this on. For now. You have a lot of cleanup to do. I have a lot of cleanup to do. I hope you and Mom are happy now. Seeing that it's worse. <laughs> it is worse than the dust collector. It's a disadvantage having the angle rather than going straight to it, just so you guys understand that. So this is what we picked up with the Rikon this time, and that's what we got with the uh, record power. Now, what happened last time, it didn't seem to happen quite the same this time. Maybe that's because of the straight through thing. Because last time I noticed... <laughs> you almost hit me in the head with that. The consistency of the sawdust. The Rikon had the majority, it was just the heavy chips. From my planer where the record had mostly fine stuff now you can see this time it's almost the same uh, maybe a few more heavy chips in the rikon than the than the record but very very similar where last time vast majority of the rikon and that's actually visible when i'm looking at the bucket you, yeah you probably could see i it noticed video. it and i didn't realize it was anything at the time i wasn't paying attention i wish i would have showed it then um but anyways yeah, are you happy now, Katie? Absolutely. Was that right? You were right. That's right. I no, believed no, you. There. <laughs> <laughs> no, but uh, anybody, <laughs> anybody else has any questions, uh, you can email me at info at stockroomsupply.com or just comment on the video. <laughs>